of different kinds. And this is a near fatal disease if untreated. Uh, one of the treatments is surgical replacement of the heart with a left ventricular assist device. This is one of our particular passions, and we are one of the leaders nationally in terms of surgical volumes and all equally importantly uh, in terms of surgical outcomes. Our two-year survival of left ventricular assist devices approaches 80%, which is one of the leading uh, results in the country. This requires a tremendous amount of participation from all of the physicians and nurses and staff that are part of this team. Over half of these operations come from other hospitals throughout the system. These patients are referred to us, and the proper therapy is designed specifically to their needs. What I do uh, is, uh, is, is care for patients who have uh, uh, simple uh, blockages of their heart who may need a bypass, or complex patients who have um, a variety of ailments to the heart, whether it be infection inside the heart, whether it be a heart that's failing for which they need a heart transplant, or someone who is not a candidate for a transplant, we now have the ability to implant heart pumps that take over the function of the heart. So in someone whose heart um, can't have bypass, can't have angioplasty, uh, there's no role for any valvular intervention, the heart muscle is failing, we're able to replace the heart with a mechanical substitute if we can't find a biologic substitute, which would be a transplant, or if the patient is waiting for a transplant, we could make that patient better and we can improve the quality of their life. The continued growth of our left ventricular assist device program and our heart transplant program is predicated on outstanding outcomes. And when you mention experience equals quality, there's no question that the more experience we have as a center, our quality continues to stay at the highest level. Every year we have a Christmas party for all of the survivors of left ventricular assist devices and heart transplant. In the first year we had this party 15 years ago, we were able to have it in the lobby of our office. And this year, in 2015, we had over 400 people at the Grand Ballroom of the Hilton Hotel, all telling their stories of how they faced death, and yet with the assist of our team,